Hey guys, how's it going? Today I'm going to show you how to draw a picket from Fantastic Beasts. So, to start off with our picket, we are going to begin with the eyes. So, I'm going to start right here, and I'm going to make a circle like this for one eye. And then I'm going to draw a circle over here for the other eye. Now, right above the eyes, I'm going to draw a little curved line above each one just to kind of show where the eyebrows are. Then, starting here, I'm going to draw a line that just kind of curves up. And then another one that's just going to kind of curve up. Then in between here, I'm just going to draw kind of like a wide V shape. So first, I want to make a little leaf up here. So starting right here, I'm going to draw a line that just kind of curves like this. And then I'm just going to kind of curve it back for one leaf. Now this other leaf, I want it to look like it's kind of folded over. So I'm going to start by drawing a line that goes up and then down like this. Then I'm going to kind of make like an S shape. So I'm going to go down and then over. And then I'm going to take this line and I'm going to draw it right back to here. And then I'm going to take this line and I'm going to draw this up to here and I'm going to bring it back right to about there. Leave a little bit of space. And then I'm just going to draw a little curve line right here. Then right here, I'm going to draw a line that just kind of comes down and goes in a little bit. And then I'm going to do the exact same thing on this side, just so we can kind of see where the head is. Now for the arms. So starting right here, I'm going to draw a line that comes down on each side, just to give a little bit of a body shape. And then right here for the arm, I'm going to draw a line that goes out, and then it's just going to come down like this. Then I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to draw a line that goes in, and then it's just going to come down. Then I'm going to take this line and I'm just going to curve it up and then I'm going to bring it back down like this. And then right here I'm going to draw this line. I'm just going to curve it right to here. And then I'm going to draw this line going up a little bit higher than the other one and then coming back down. Now, over here, I'm going to start right here, and I'm going to draw a line that goes out and then kind of down. Then I'm going to bring it in like this. Then, starting here, I'm going to go kind of curve it down and then bring it in. Then this hand is actually going to have a few more of these little kind of like long kind of root things coming off. So I'm going to curve this one around and I'm just going to kind of curve it like this and then come back. Then I'm going to make another one a little bit different shape. And then this last one is just going to be a lot smaller and I'm just going to connect it to here.
Then starting right here, I'm going to just draw a line that goes down to here. And then right here, I'm just going to draw a line that just comes down to here. Then for the legs, so he kind of has these three different odd shaped legs. So starting right here, I'm going to draw a line that just kind of curves and just kind of goes down an angle like this. Then I'm going to make my line go across and then come back and then I'm just going to kind of redraw that same shape until I get to the hand. Then I'm going to start right here and I'm just going to draw a line that goes out and then I'm just going to bring it down here and I'm just going to kind of curve around, make this one go up a little bit and then come back. I'll draw a little line right here just to show where that other leg is. And then over here I'm going to draw a line that goes out and then kind of down and just add an angle so it looks a little different. And then I'm just going to redraw that shape like this, and then I'll connect it right to here. Then, right up here, I'm just going to give him a little smile. And then right here, I'm going to make a little line that goes down. And then I'm just going to put some V shapes on here to make it look more like a leaf. And then I'm just going to add a couple little lines on this one with some V shapes just to show that it looks a lot more like a leaf. And there you go. There is your drawing of a picket from Fantastic Beasts. I'm going to fast forward and start coloring this. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed.